30 seconds until minions spawn. It's okay, Connell. If you're having success with the with more of a tanky build, then go for that. You like can revitalize feel difference? You can take revitalize and second wind and bone plating. As of this patch. Ban Camille? Oh yeah, maybe I should just ban Camille. I'm gonna stick around and look for Cyan Cheese. We should be good. Let me ward this as well. I just want to make sure that I wasn't going to come to lane and this guy is going to take red. You know, that guy stunning the creeps actually got me that minion. Oh, the Conqueror? Yeah, I don't think so either. You got the wave pressure advantage just because of, uh, you know, he came to lane first. Let's go ahead and get way the fuck out of here. Okay, that should push back to me. Mm, he might be able to push in time, I'm not sure. I was actually poorly played on my part. I think Sion could have maybe played that better and lived, but... Yeah, I almost fucked it up. I meant to, like, auto as I ignited, but I was still stunned. So, yeah, that's poorly played mechanically. Why lifesteal? I mean, lifesteal is good against poke, first of all. Second, lifesteal works with your revitalize. What are these gaming rocks you advertise? It's uh, my sponsor. We're hosting an event, I think, on March 7th or something. You know, like sometime early March. You know, I'll give you guys details then. If you guys want, you can sign up to the gaming.rock site. And uh, make an account, you know, follow me on the site. Uh, at fog for the win 2 And uh, you'll be able to participate in the event where there'll be like RP giveaways and shit. Okay. I don't know why Cyan just randomly backed, but uh, he just lost, uh, you know, several minions because of it. He lost at least two minions of EXP, three minions of gold. Okay. 
Okay, so I'm 13 CS and I got a kill on him. So we're pretty far ahead of the sign. Jesus, I got wrecked. Holy fuck! My right arm is a Yo, lot video stronger gamer, thanks for than my left arm. I appreciate it. <laughs> Damn, Wayne's also pushing back to him. My you know, instead of running back towards my turret, I should have ran down. I think I could have lived. If I did that, because he was already running towards the next brush. As you wish. Yeah, how much it my bone plating reduces twenty nine damage for the next three spells or autos, which is pretty good. Push me in. Reason being is I don't have ult. I don't want to get regained by Ringar. to focus on trying to get turret. Killing Scion too. It's pretty good. Awesome. I got a stack ship. That's a really good buy. Oh, 
I'm just gonna go back top. It's a fat wave just waiting for me. Some people are saying that the Rengar Revert made Rengar weaker, and some people are saying it made him stronger. Which is it? Well, I might back to this build because it uh, works better. Like, I'll always go the build that works the best. You guys want to know the biggest reason why uh, I'm going back to this build? It's because the nerf to like the tankiness of ADCs. Like, yeah. <laughs> Shit, boys. I'm gonna build up my static shiv. Rengar might come for these wolves. If he does, I wanna be able to kill him. My okay, never mind, he's not coming. So, just moving around helps build my shiv back up. Do you build team at versus tanks? Yes. So against like Maokai and Malphite, I will still build team at. But I'll be going more of a crit team at build. Emmy is definitely an up-and-coming trend main. She's working her way up. Your turret has been destroyed. What's the reasoning behind team at versus tanks? Earlier wave pressure. By the time you get your dueling items with like, uh, you know, your stack shiv and cutlass or whatever, that's gonna be too late to, you know, try to really run down tanks. The reason why I don't build team up versus sign is because it won't affect him either way. Like, building the team up, I won't be able to pressure him with it. That's a good call, whoever made that. Works out. Um, let me go for Merc Treads again. It'll be good for the Rengar Bola. Yeah, Emmy was popping off. I 
go to spot side. I can't really, even though I'm two levels up and, you know, like, 70 CS up in the science, it can be hard to pressure him. Because Rengar's so fed. Okay. Never mind. Rengar just went topside, so I'm gonna use the Herald now. I use Herald, like, instantly, instead of waiting for, you know, being closer to turret. Because I don't want Cyan to stop me from using the Herald with this CC. Okay, I need a backup. Rengar is coming back bottom. Rengar has so much pressure on the map. I went to get this turret, but uh, I thought because I thought Rengar stopped. But he ended up just uh, heading back towards bottom as soon as I cast the rift. Awesome. So I got a really good trade because he extended two for out. Oh my god. Damn. I fucked up my spin. I should have spun farther. That's the only reason I didn't kill her. We have like no vision. We have no peel against uh, Rengar as well, because oh we have brand support. <laughs> Alright, well we get fire I guess. I think I just saw them all rotating through. I am your worst nightmare. Hmm. I think instead of bone pudding and cyan, I'm gonna take demolish next time. Yeah, bone pudding reduces some of his uh, his poke. I really don't have a problem with this boat.
I don't think a bone plating is a must for every matchup, but it definitely does help in a lot of matchups. My team is just not in a good position to pressure anything if Rengar goes for me. This'll be a slaughter. Mm, he should hit the Baron. Would have done more damage than zero. Well, at least if I die bottom now to Rengar gang. My then, right uh, arm is a lot Yo, Spice Igloo, thanks for reset five arm. months in a row. <laughs> I appreciate it. Five months of bowling arm. Hashtag just Trindamir things. Yeah. If uh, they go for me now, bottom, then we can at least clear the burn pit. Five months of bowling arm? I do you a professional bowler now or what? The tower of that's yes. Alright, I got Essence Reaver. I'm just gonna back. Do I need Essence Reaver? Do I need the extra mobility? Or can I just one shot the vein? Well, she has tabbies. I wonder. Essence Reaver's like, it's always good, but maybe Infinity Edge could be better. I'm just gonna go with Essence Reaver's because what I know. But I, I'm just like thinking to myself, maybe Infinity Edge could net me a one shot with an E Flash. But Essence Reaver will help me keep on top of Rengar with his kiting. I'm gonna cheat towards Baron. They do have Cassiopeia, Zyra, Vayne. They do Baron so quickly. Oh, didn't get my Q off in time. I think I would have died the auto still, maybe. Well, I don't think they can get Baron, because we have a jungler up, they don't. So that's good at least. Oh, he got War Mogs? Okay, yeah. There's no splitting versus him. He'll just, like, regen way too much. Yeah, Essence Reaver is way worth there. Do you use a hockey to laugh during your spin? No, I do it manually, every single time. I'm not gonna get Last Whisper. Reason being is I won't be able to, you know, poke uh, Cyan out. Nor will I be able to all win him in the split push. So he's kind of like negating what I want to do. It'd be fine if I had more time to trade and split against him. But I really just don't have enough time before Rengar or someone else gets on me.
I was looking for places where Rengar might be hiding. Gem, so I'm not too worried. Even if Rengar ults on me, I'll be able to kill him. Hmm, they're not heading towards Baron. I don't think. Yeah, they're all just backing. Awesome. I might have time to get this turret. Oh shit, I wasn't looking. Mm, I might have to rotate quickly to Baron. Rengar's around because his raptors are gone. I got the vein, but then I goes doing too well. All right, I got Infinity Edge now. Too bad. I mean, Echo's getting a lot of damage. I also got healed from Bane. Is this your build now? Yeah, that's my build, Kokuto. <clears throat> I'm thinking about getting like a Yamas. Because really, the only one with armor is Scion, right? Oh I can't split burst him. I won't be able to pressure him enough. And I can't really ignore him and hit the turret because he insta clears my wave. It's a tricky situation. However, getting Last Whisper here, if Sign wants to push up like this, would be worth.
It's good that Brand's buying a lot of pinks, so we can keep Vision Baron. It's really helped a lot a lot this game. Fuck, we can't let them have triple fire. Can't let them have a third infernal. That's just like GG. If they get it. We'll have to withstand the Baron Crush. Wow. We actually got an insta pick on Vayne? Hey, let's fucking go. Hey, I'm in here. Wait, we just like win the game? Wow, they that vein really fucked up. We just played patiently, and uh, I mean, Vayne, Vayne made one mistake, and we just won. <laughs> All right, nice.